Uh, so this story starts with me seeing a Facebook post where it was written that they were looking for someone to help with their short movie making. And as you know me, I was like, why not? And it's actually being shot in Nelson's Bay, so I'm going there for two days. It's gonna be fun. Guys, how are you? I didn't know what to expect or what kind of movie it was. I thought it was just another short movie that people do as their hobby. We were on the road trip for 3 hours and finally we reached the place. I loved the place in an instant. A 160 years old house in the suburbs gave me a chill the moment I looked at it. This place smells, smells like real bad. This place is haunted. I still didn't know what was going to happen or what the suit would be like, but I could easily guess by the set that it was a horror movie. For the first day, I was just trying to figure out what was going on, and trying to help wherever I could and whenever I could. Underwater the lightning, very very frightening. So it's 10 p.m. and we're fixing the lighting. Can you hold the, yeah. the lighting setup from the outside? This is how it looks from the inside. I hadn't had a good sleep the previous night, so wasn't there with my whole energy. But looking at the actors work with so much excitement, that kept me going. I am having a bit of knowledge about lighting, a bit hey about guys. direction and everything. These guys are going to be set in a couple of He's minutes. He's the director. So you guys ready? Yeah. Okay. Right. Those are our camera persons. By the end of the first day, I had realized that this was bigger than what I thought. So it's 0.48 in the morning and I broke my glasses. And we're still filming. <laughs> it's 20 in the morning and finally it's a wrap for day one. The second day was quite rainy and we were hoping that it won't rain during the soup. Please my friend, go that way. Go that way please. By now I had figured out a lot of stuff and was into the shoot as a true crew member. So what's going on here? So we're actually setting up the lights and everything for now so that our first scene is there. Actually that's the bike we're gonna have our first scene in and for that we're just setting up the set as of now. We're going to shoot as soon as it gets dark, so yeah, basically we're waiting for nature to get dark. 
Everything requires a lot of planning. Which shot? Which angle? Each shot requires the light setup, rig setup, and scene setup. Once this is ready, you let the actors know and let them practice. And then... Down. Space on. Down and rolling. Pause left. Scene 38, shot A, take 1. Mark. Trying to set up this light. So the rain has fucked up our shoot for the second time in the day. Oh, the clock's ticking, man. Every suit has seen shots and takes. Each scene has different shots, or in lemon language, different angles. And each shot need different takes to get what the director is actually looking for. dedicated and so real. I felt so sorry for this character and was scared during the shoot because their acting was so good. Jack. He's burned all of this. <laughs> so it's 2.42 a.m. and we just finished our shoot for the movie. It's a wrap for today. Yeah, yeah. And I know you guys wouldn't be able to see the view out here, but the Milky Way is awesome. When would this movie be released? Fuck. Um, maybe August. August? August, somewhere like that, yeah. Oh. So how do you choose whom to bring back? <laughs> or not? What, whoever the director tells me to. <laughs> <laughs> as, as, as the night creeps in, I'm gonna do awful mm. things and bury That's my wife. <laughs> what do you think about all of this? <laughs> Wait again. <laughs> hey bro, check out the jacket I got you. Actually no. <laughs> <laughs>